we're gonna start by exiting the welcome screen with a file open and double click your file to open it we're gonna zoom out with control minus and resize the image with the selection tool which is this black arrow on the source bar go to the corner of the image hold down shift and drag and move it back into the artboard now zoom back in with control plus okay in this options bar which is right here um, you can see a live trace button but don't click it because we don't we're not going to use it in this case so go to the arrow go to tracing options and click OK you see this option right here ignore white don't check it off because I'm gonna show you what happens if you don't check it off so click trace and click expand now click out of it um, press the keyboard shortcut control Y this will show the, you the outline of your file as you can see there's a box that surrounds the image this is because we did not check off ignore white and thus making this file not um, com uh, applicable for laser vinyl and shop bot machines um, so we need to go back and to to undo well first go back to regular viewing mode with control Y and we need to undo everything by control Z okay see in the options bar expand is still back one more time control Z okay there now you see the live trace button now go back to the arrow go to tracing options again click OK and check off ignore white click trace okay and from here you can edit the thresh threshold which is like um, just what you prefer just mess around with it and you'll notice the changes in your image so we're going to click expand now click out and press control I the box disappeared so that's good your file is now um, ready um, and file save as we're going to save it as in the, uh, we can either save it as a PDF for laser cutting machine only but for the, for the vinyl and the shop bot we have to save it as an Adobe Illustrator file I'm just going to save it as an Illustrator file for now oh. click save and um click okay there you go